If you're self-employed and not a client unternehmer, then you've probably wondered about how often and when you actually have to submit your advanced UST return and whether you can change this somehow. I'll give you the answers to this question in this video. Hi, my name is Mel here from Contest Tax Consulting and in this video we would like to cover the whole topic of advanced return for Umsatzsteuer and by when and for which period it has to be done. First of all, the most important thing you can't choose when you do your advanced UST return. The frequency of your advanced UST return, whether it is the year, the quarter, or the month, is always determined by how much Umsatzsteuer you had to pay in total in the last year. So, what is the advanced return for UST tax? You usually indicate sales tax on your invoices and then receive this money as a gross amount from your customers. This sales tax that you receive from your customers is called Umsatzsteuer. Of course, you also have costs and regularly transfer money to suppliers, to your landlord, or for train tickets, gas receipts, and so on. Almost everything that incurs costs for you indicates on the invoices a sales tax, and you can claim the sales tax back. So you pay a gross amount on those invoices, and the UST tax, which is included in these invoices, is the so-called input tax, and you can offset that. This means that for a given period, you can always calculate the total sum of the UST tax minus the total number of the input tax that you paid. This results either in a UST payment, if you have more sales tax than input tax, or what's also possible, if you have more costs, then the input tax amount is higher. In this case, if you get a negative amount, then you get the input tax refunded by the tax office. The big question is, how often do you have to do this? And that is determined by how much sales tax you had to pay in the last year. If you have relatively low sales, and say you do this as a part-time job, for example, and you're under 1,000 euros UST payment per year in the previous year, then the calendar year applies to you. This means that you do not have to make any advanced UST returns during the year. It's enough to do a simple UST return once a year, that's it. If you had to pay between 1,000 and 7,500 euros in total UST tax to the tax office, then you have to pay quarterly. This means that you have to calculate the sales tax minus the input tax on a quarterly basis and pay the corresponding amount or get a refund depending. If you paid more than 7,500 euros UST in the last year, then the monthly payments are your thing. Then you have to calculate this every month and submit a monthly advance return for the Umsatzsteuer and make the corresponding advance payment or again possibly get a refund. Since this whole calculation always refers to the previous year, it's possible of course that this frequency changes because of course sales rise and fall and costs are also sometimes higher or lower. This means that it is always possible Possible that your UST advanced return frequency changes every year. As a rule, you will receive a letter in January, February from the tax office, that is every time you have submitted the last advanced return for UST tax to the tax office, but only if something has changed. For example, if you previously submitted an advanced UST return every month, but now your total UST payment has been less than 7,500 euros, you will get a letter from the tax office telling you that from now on you have to submit the advanced return on a quarterly basis. Of course, your frequency can change a little every year. And unfortunately, it is not possible to make a request yourself that you wish to have a different frequency. I hope this short video helped you. If you have any other tax related questions, feel free to write a comment below this video. If you are interested in the services of Contest Tax Consulting, you can find all the information below this video. Otherwise, you are welcome to watch these videos here and here, and I look forward to seeing you again next time.